I'm Gigi and I am the Amazon Interview Wiz. For those of you who know the Amazon Interview Wiz, you might want to skip forward a few seconds. If you don't, I worked for Amazon for just short of five years and in that time I led about 350 interviews and was an Amazon Interview Bar Raiser. Uh, in Amazon, an interview bar raiser is about 5% of all employees and ostensibly their job is to facilitate the interview process and are ultimately responsible for making the right decision to either hire or not hire a candidate. Okay, so today's content is the truth that no one else is telling you about the tell me about yourself question that you might get at an Amazon interview. Okay, you ready? So the truth. Don't tell anyone else if I tell you, but the truth is, it's just a warm-up question. No one is going to make a decision to hire you or not hire you based on your answer to that question, unless you say something really compromising. Interviewing is just a super weird set of situations, right? two complete strangers meeting each other for the first time, maybe physically in the same place, maybe over the internet, meeting each other for the first time, maybe something in common, maybe nothing in common, maybe meet each other again, maybe never meet each other again. It's a super weird set of circumstances. So quite often interviewers will use a question like, tell me about yourself, just as an icebreaker, just to get to know you a little bit, make you feel a little bit more comfortable, make them feel a little more comfortable, and create some kind of a connection between the two of you. But what you really want to do is maximise the amount of time on your interview spent on the leadership principle competency-based questions, because it's those questions and the answers to those questions that will provide the evidence to prove whether you are or are not a candidate that they want to hire. So my advice is, when you are asked that question, if you are asked that question, to make your answer super short, super straight to the point, maybe just two or three sentences, give the interviewer just a little bit of information to give them a sense of your personality, maybe give them a little bit of information about why you're here, and then give them some kind of a segue into the next stage, which will be about asking you the competency questions. Something like, and I'm super excited to be at these interviews today. That makes it really easy for them to be able to move on and get to the questions and to the heart of the interview. So that's it. Don't overthink it. Don't over labor it. If you feel you've fluffed up a little bit, don't worry about it because no one's using that as evidence to hire you or not. Just short, sharp, straight to the point, create a little bit of a connection and then give your interviewer that segue to move into the leadership principle questions. So, Hopefully that was helpful. As I say, shh, don't tell anybody else. Big secret. Hope that was helpful and I'll see you next time.